Yo, what is good everybody? Welcome back to another video and I am here for the very first time playing Legacy Peace. That's right, a new One Piece game released today. Now, if you don't know what Legacy Peace is, well, um, hate to break it to you, I, I didn't know what it was either. Bruh. When I first saw it, I thought it was going to be another Bruh. bandit beating One Piece game. And that's what it kind of is. Now what I will say is the game has amazing animations, amazing models, amazing effects, and great ideas on the fruits themselves as you can tell from this clip right here. Wax with boxing gloves? That's insane. And then we also have the weapon fruit where you could turn into a weapon and then turn into a cannon and then turn into a missile where you could fly. It's just, it's really creative. And also look at the bosses themselves. So there are signs that this game can be good now as you can already tell i am level 32 so let me go ahead and run through and make a quick summary of what i've experienced so far so at the beginning i woke up from my bed yawning looking ugly as usual and i went outside and did a couple quest npcs i first delivered a letter to a lady who was kind of bad no lie and she told me to give some alcohol to dadan however you pronounce her name the fat mountain bounty lady i gave her some alcohol because she's an alcoholic and then she made me go beat up her subordinates or some other bandits for some reason which i did and the pvp is not too bad there's air combos blocking parrying you know all the basic things you need in good pvp it doesn't have evasives though then i went back to the village started doing some more slave work by picking up some carrots getting rice getting beetroots like just being a slave then suddenly this old man gave me a quest to save his kid from the other mountain bandit yeah that guy got smoked and he gave me his sword from there i continued doing quests and i ended up fighting a boar with armor it was interesting he tried to lay on me but he ended up dying a couple levels later i ended up boating into another island defeating alvira getting her mace and then ending up where i'm at right now so this is where i'm gonna start the video at now let's go ahead and enter our inventory and check out the items that we have currently. So we have Bomb Bomb Combat, the Devil Fruit, the Legendary Devil Fruit, although it does say rare on the Trello, but still a legendary fruit. Apparently, I found on the floor while I was doing the Zoro quest on this island, which was pretty damn lucky of me because Bomb is pretty cool to play around with, although I only have one move. We also have Iguma's sword, Kobe's glasses, I'm gonna put that on. We also have the iron mace from Alvira, and of course, a flintlock and a bazooka, which I bought from the shop right behind me. They were just selling it in this area. And you know what? Since I have a little bit of cash, these swords don't look too bad. Dororo sword, I might buy that. Give me that. And this is where we're gonna continue our journey. It might not look much, but if I talk to this guy who's apparently dying by a sword going through his chest, He'll tell me that Axe Hand Morgan is inside this building, and there he is, <laughs> Axe Hand Morgan. Now, for some reason, Fist is just the best fighting style in the game early on. It has great attack speed and great damage, so I just, I guess I'm just box up Axe Hand Morgan, or he'll just run me down. Yep, yeah, just, just fist me at this point, you know? Yeah, just keep going. Yeah, just keep going. I like it. Hey, yep. Just do Fist Barrage. Yes, sir. And then I'll go ahead and back up, use Bomb, shoot the Bomb. Only 10 damage though. What? Uh, it's it's like true hit stun, so you can't even evasive out of the attack. It's so annoying. But that's what also makes the combat even worse. You could infinite combo these bosses if you really wanted to. Like, well, not really infinite combo them, but just uh, make it so they can't attack back. Oh, he spawned his kids. Child abuse will not be tolerated, but it was your fault. You sent him out first. Oh, I'm cooked. Oh. You're still alive after a rocket? Air combo into the punching barrage. There we go. Axe and Morgan has been defeated. Blah, 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 blah. Onto the next island. Uh, what is, is this Marine tweaking? Bro's off the perks. What the hell? Oh, yeah, he's definitely, he's definitely on something. And now I'm going to continue doing that until I'm level 40. Because according to the Trello, this is level 25 to level 40. So I'm going to be sitting here doing the same raid over and over and over and over and over again like every other one piece game what is this infinite combo what is, uh, 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 huh? 
Huh? Bro, they did the back-to-back -back fucking Mario Luigi ass combo. You see that? I could not move. Okay, we grinded for a hot minute now. We're level 43, and we still didn't get a single Axe Hand Morgan drop. So I'm done with this place. I'm buying a new boat, the warship, and I'm moving to the next island. Damn, look at that ship, though. Great design. And we're here. New island, new place to discover, new quest more bandits to beat let's go ahead and talk to the next npc that could give me a quest yada 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 i'm not reading all that what's the quest deliver swords all the way up there <laughs> who the fuck do you think i am bro thinks i could climb roofs and just run across it all right there you go there's your sword and now zero out of three spars and defeat two student and instructors so if i take out a bazooka does this still consider as being uh, as sparring because i don't boom nice unibrow what do you got yeah 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 something 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 about wolves bro i am not crossing this ocean do you think i'm michael phelps like what oh there's there's a bridge right there. <laughs> okay. Ooh, look at the wolves. Damn, it's bright. Damn, it's bright as hell. Look at the model, though. Really cool. Look yeah, he's kind of cute. But not cute enough for me to not kill it. Mm -mm. Wait, I could swim with a double fruit. Is it because I'm a fishman? Because you can see my fin back there. You can't really see it with my hair, but I am a fishman. Is that kind of how it works? But I could just like, I could touch the bottom. Oh, oh, maybe too far. Oh, maybe too far. Hey, you, you're finally awake. Well, that was a great transition. Um. <laughs> Okay, the game updated, but they did add some more codes. So the first one is... All right, I'm gonna go to the menu and reroll my race because I don't want Fishman. I want something cooler. Okay, spin menu. I have 15 spins. 2% chance to get Oni and 5% chance to get Make. Those are the only two that I want. So let's go ahead and start spinning. Come on, come on. Give me something good. Uh, okay, I just... I'm a human again. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip. If I, I'm, I'm gonna skip to the end and see if I get anything good. Ooh! I've become albino and a furry. Look at my tail. Look at me wag my tail. Okay, that's enough of that. But yes, or a mink, not a noni. But I will take mink. I do believe minks have fighting styles. All right, next quest. Oh, damn! Look at that archaeologist. All right, what are we digging up? All right, what are we digging up, huh? I wanted to do something else. All right, we're Blue's Clues up in this bitch. What are we trying to find? Burr. Interesting. There's a horn supposedly from some beast. Hmm. I'm going to take a wild guess. A shot in the dark that it's going to be a Yeti. Oh, uh, this this seems more cozy. All right. I'm guessing that's the only place to go through. So I'll just go. I'll just yank it open. I wouldn't jump in that Kool-Aid. All right. I guess we're going in. Ah, Hello. yeah, I was right. All right. Can I just... Oh, oh my god. He does not like the gun. He does not like the... Wait. No shot. Can you really just stand behind this barrier and shoot him with the gun? Oh my... Wait. Yeah, you can. Bro. Devs. You can't let sh like this slide. <laughs> people will take advantage. Thank god I'm not one of those people because I'm going in. Let's go. All right, drop landmines, walk through. Yo, let's go. Weave. Oh, this boss fight's kind of nice. The screen shade's kind of... Oh my god, the screen shade's cancer. Fix that, please. Oh, nine damage, though. Let's place down landmines, walk through. Throw explosive shot, go back in. Can we do an air combo on the Yeti? Oh, he doesn't go up, though. Oh, he does. What the hell? All right, bro's a submarine. Oh Are you a submarine? Hey, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Yeti AI, bro. All right, we go back in. Place mines. Nice. Go behind him. Just finish him off. Just finish him off. Just finish him off. Huh? 
Hey, yo, pause, but just, just finish him. And him. Yes. There we go. Now, I'm going to do him again. Pause. I'm going to do him again so I could uh, get some of those drops because they seem kind of interesting. Oh, we got a boss drop. Please let it be the drippy fur cloak. I take the sword too, but drippy fur cloak? Yes, drippy fur coat. Epic utility. We're going to go ahead and equip that. Oh my god, look at me. Look at me. And we're on the next island. Not the best uh, parking for my boat, but we'll take what we could get. We'll set our new spawn here and continue with our quest. So I got to get this mentally ill person some medicine. So let me go ahead and get that really quickly. And that, that, that looks a little menacing. Is that Buggy the Clown's, is that Buggy the Clown's little circus area? Hey, if we fight Buggy in his emperor form, that, that would be next level deving. That would be next level deving right there. I would love that. Now we got to talk to Choo Choo, whoever the, oh. Why does he look like that? Just an ugly looking dog. Oh, that's um, that's a big wolf. Is that Finn the human? Oh my god, he has a whip. Oh my god, he has a whip. I need your whip. I need that whip right now. Give me that whip. If I can whip people in this game, that is the ultimate, ultimate weapon. Ultimate weapon. He's whipping me. Oh my god. That's f***ing amazing. I need the whip right now. I didn't get the whip. All right, big dog. Uh, are you okay? Are you gonna hit me? Hit me then, come on. Hit me? Oh, he's a good boy. He just, he just missed. Uh, ooh, uh, oh, uh, he just misunderstood. Oh my god, boss drop, no shot, 5% chance for the whip. Oh my god, we got it. We got the whip. Let's go. This is the most I've been excited this entire game besides getting that fruit. Oh my god. We can whip people. Get back to work! Yes, get back to work! You filthy doesn't! Get to work! Now it's time for the big boy. It's time for Buggy. Give me your daggers. I got the whip. Now give me your daggers. Come here. You know how you can't be affected by swords? Nobody said you can't get affected by whips! So I'm gonna whip you to death, huh? How's it feel, huh? Your ancestors must be shaking. Your ancestors must be twisting in their graves. Okay, chill. What the hell is happening? Damn, bro, this guy, he, he can make cannons aggro onto me. Yeah, this boss fight's kind of nice. Better than the other ones, I will say that. But still, the AI on these uh, NPCs are pretty brain dead. Oh my god. He's almost dead. Yeah, I'm whipping you to death. Yeah, that's right. Oh, we got some cash. But there we go. That's it. We got a whip. We got new drip. We got the bomb fruit. We're doing really good in this game. But um, so far, I'll say that legacy piece is a it's an okay game better than most one piece bandit beaters it has some unique quest here and there i do like the boss fights and their abilities they are really that smart alongside with the npcs as you can see yeah the npcs are uh, they're they aren't really that uh, intelligent but still anyways i'll leave the game link in the description so you guys can check it out for yourself and tell me what you guys think. I'll probably be playing this off camera or make another progression video. But that's it for me. I'll see you guys later. Peace.